Well, I decided to, to go back because first of all, um, I was planning to still racing, um, not in Formula One, but in another category. Uh, that's what I love to do. Uh, definitely, I wanted to race in the team or in the situation that I really feel important, that I really feel that maybe my experience can be important for the team, not just to be on the back, not just to, to be part of Formula One. This I'm not interested. I'm mm -hmm. trusting to be important. I'm trusting to be competitive. And, uh, and definitely Williams, is, it is a team that I can feel that. It is a team that um, after everything that it happens in the last three years, uh, I think I was important, you know, for, for all the improvement, for all the uh, position, uh, result that uh, we had. So definitely when everything happens after Nico's uh, retirement, you know, uh, that nobody expected. So I had this call from uh, Claire Williams and uh, she asked me uh, if I was, uh, if, if I agree uh, to stop my retirement, which never happens actually, you know. <laughs> so then definitely, I mean, uh, we need a little bit of uh, time to keep talking, uh, uh, trying to understand all the plans from the team, uh, trying to understand everything about the new rules, that this is, it was really uh, why I decided to, to go back. Because uh, first of all, the team wants to have me back in the t uh, inside. Uh, and um, and the second, so it was is is going to be a completely different uh, scenario uh, for the new rules. Mm. So all of these things was really important. And the most important thing is that uh, all the fans and all the people in the road uh, message. It was amazing. So I had a lot of uh, uh, incredible feelings. You know, when the, everybody was really pushing me to go back, and I, I think really that's really. Uh, gave me a lot more motivation and um, I'm really ready to, to carry on. Uh, I had an amazing retirement that I think maybe nobody had in Formula 1. The same re type of uh, uh, feelings that I had from uh, everybody. So um, I didn't expect it, you know, but um, things change in life and uh, I think it was maybe a, a direction that I had maybe from God or whatever, that uh, it just gave me a lot of motivation and uh, maybe my time is not finished yet, you know, in Formula One. Maybe I still need to do some, some more races, some more championships. And uh, yeah, I'm really, I didn't expect, I think nobody expected, you know, but uh, for all of this change, uh, I got a, a nice and uh, really happy um, uh, happenings, you know, really happy opportunity that uh, it happens and uh, I really feel uh, happy with my decision again. <laughs> well, my plan is to be really, really, really important for the team, really important for, uh, to understand everything that it will be different for the new rules. It is going to be a big change in the rules and nobody knows where it's going to be. Nobody knows who will be the best team. Nobody knows a lot about these new rules. So I'm sure my experience will make uh, some result and uh, I really hope that um, we can have a nice work together with the team and uh, we can be competitive. So, uh, so many things uh, is happening also inside the team, inside Williams, uh, to trying to be better um, than last year. So, that um, I really hope uh, we can uh, uh, be in a good position and we, we can be able to fight with some top teams like we did uh, in these last three years.